Uh, hello everyone. I hope you don't worry why I'm doing this thing, because. Uh, today is actually about just you know trimming up on the topics that we did last time on the last episode so this is actually the uh, following episode uh, on the last one so this is your poem my pxd i'm with kelvin i'm with solo uh, we're gonna be just having you know uh just a short conversation about the most recent topics and the most recent news about you know the things that we've been talking about on the last topic in which you already know in which you don't know you can go and then click on the in the video that we did previously and you're gonna be see what we've been talking about in by the way we've been talking about the the drugs uh the Yes, the crimes that are, are happening in the community yeah. and less opportunities that we are facing as a community i just want to get you in tune to what we have to talk about so if you are here just looking for entertainment only in which you know doesn't benefit you with anything like i said last time we are not about the content that we some so if you are here to grasp a little bit about you know the things that you think are faced by the youth are faced by yourself are faced by anyone maybe that uh, might be close to you uh you are here this is the right place so if you are here for something else i'm sorry you just have to leave right now no no hard feelings no hard feelings we just here <laughs> we just here to move forward this content is about moving forward so we are actually willing to take charge and we are willing to take part so it's just about you know getting the content together it's about a beneficial content it's about you know moving forward it's about the progress so if you're not about the progress i'm sorry so yo boys I hope you get something out of this. So before we even start talking, just grab a pen and a paper, uh, so that or maybe you just use your phone. But you're gonna be watching this video, so just grab a pen and a paper yes, to write to write uh, useful points that you might think uh, you can use to dig on your research a little bit, or questions that you might like to ask on the comment section. So that's why you get to ask us the questions and you get to ask us the things uh, in which you want us to do you want to know uh, uh, certain things about what we're going to be talking about or what we are talking about and if we don't have the answers for that we're going to go to the people who can give us the answers so make sure Uti, you listen and you, you say something and then we're going to take it from there because this is a, actually an ongoing process in which we want everybody to get engaged on the song. Everybody has Bam! Talk. We know how it is. Cabby boy! Okay, so my guy, um, as you have Before we start, before we start, yeah. I'm sorry to stop you there. Yeah. Are you feeling good today, my man? Man, I'm feeling amazing. Touch my blood. You already know. You already Touch know. Touch my blood. Yes, sir. Touch yes, my sir. blood. Yes, sir. All right, all right, let's go. So, on the stuff that you mentioned, um, first, let's talk about drugs. What's your ground sense on drugs? What do you think about the drugs in the community, especially in Pritchett What do I think about yeah. drugs? Dwellings. You mean illegal drugs, right? Yeah. Well, um, what I can say about it is that, uh, as, as much as everybody knows, it's something that is affect, has affected almost, if not 50, up to 60 or 70 percent of the youth yeah. uh, in that almost in uh, almost every province south africa worldwide so these particular things are, are particularly the things that i think um are going to demolish the the future of this country yeah. in terms yeah. of true, you know true, true. In, in terms of economy yeah. in terms of careers in terms of jobs mm. in terms of just the country uh, 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 having a stability in everything yeah so drugs are actually something that's as everybody knows yeah it's something that's uh killing but it's a weapon yeah. so so as much as you know it's you, weapon you, of mass destruction listen yeah yeah because because you've been in, you've been in pretoria yeah. you've been in pretoria uh they've been in Jobek. uh he's been uh in, uh, in durban in durban, durban bro. so so these things will tell you when you go out you realize that okay as much as we're getting affected in the small towns in bigger cities it's happening yeah. it's going down it's going down and uh, I've, I've seen that some people are actually taking charge in some of the bigger cities and trying to clean up the community yeah. so, so i just i just mm -hmm. have one question what effects do you think the drugs have on the on the community as a whole what yeah. do you think the drugs have the effects yeah well, what I can say, Mbetu. What I can say about that, Mbetu, is that um, 
Well, it makes some people rich, definitely. Yeah, definitely. Yeah, yeah. Oh, no, no, Chang Chang. No. Looking at the ground side. Looking it's at the ground side. Yeah. Well, well, well. Like that's what I'm saying. Uh, some some people, yeah. Ne, yeah. some people, ne, uh, the drug dealers. Yeah. Some of them are local people. Mm. You understand? Yeah. That's, that's the problem that we say. Some of them are local people. Yeah. And uh, when 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 we get to to look at the effects that. Uh, are being done by the drugs yeah they are being done upon the locals yeah no so if i mention the dealers i mention the local people as well in which it's the consumers as well so among consumers what i can say about them is that obviously it's the effects that are happening in their lives you can literally witness it yeah and the our mom or sister anyone that passes in town uh, to certain hotspots where the drugs are being sold or the drugs are being consumed or where they being used you, you will realize you will realize you see the map of my effects are hard in the one matter in our community so yeah. that, that 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 i won't be even much on 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 especially on the part that um most it's locals I won't say most it's locals, but dealers. some of them it's locals. Dealers say so. The problem here is uh, a lot of people think it's outsiders who are dealing drugs, mm -hmm. but we, we we have witnessed we see even locals are engaging in that activity. So it's, it has become a, a huge problem. What do you think can be done to to, to prevent such thing from happening? Well, um. It's obviously, you know, coming together as a as a community, basically, and just uh, get ways to uh, eradicate and address these situations. We could have uh, organizations, we could have meetings, we could have whatever it is that can be a way forward yeah. as a community. But yeah. first things in first, we have to hold our hands together. We have to we have to be a, a unity. Yeah. We have to because if we are not united, then it means. We, the ideologies will clash automatically so that's my that's my only concern about if we we have one mindset and we all do one thing it will shall, it, it will be a success in jail without any yeah, any flow yeah. without any glitches i'm told exactly. but as much as now it brings me to 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 the operation to do the thing in that's what i was about to say yeah. actually they are doing in, a in good which job. in which in yeah. which operation to do that guys is actually an implementation in which is what we've been talking and been thinking about on the show okay. and in general as a machita when we sit around so this operation to do like guys they're actually you know doing something that relates way more is 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 affecting us on a on a bigger round so if you if you follow the to do that thing yeah you will realize that as much as it is a positive thing in the community, as much as it is a positive, positive implementation in the community, a lot of people, apart from the people who are supporting it, yeah, are actually looking for the negatives. In it, yeah, yeah, true that. Yeah. Hence, so, that guy is got arrested. Yeah, just, the guy just got arrested, and. Um, if you look at this thing close, it was something that was orchestrated. Yeah. It was something because come on, come. Okay. <laughs> Guys, this is my <laughs> opinion. Don't say so much. Don't say so much. Don't say so much. Don't say so much. So 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 what I'm saying eh, is that look at it from a just just a general perspective. Okay. These guys they 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 come in the raid yeah so you know before a raid is a preparation right yeah 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 so obviously the members and anybody that takes part maybe they, there's a meeting and we are going to say hey tomorrow we are going to the place we are going to the place so if i'm friends with the person that you are telling me that you are going to tomorrow do you think i won't want them so as much as they didn't find drugs on the premises where they went to yeah so it automatically turns into a breaking crime or what was the person will feel violated in a way yeah yeah they are, they are, yeah, true, they are true, yeah obviously you know uh, orchestrated to you know they went there with information Ooh. they went there with the tribe they went there 
with assurance that they will get something and they will probably fix something. The community was a part of it. Yeah. Because it's the people from the community that actually told these guys and told the cops that uh, that is a hot spot, those guys are dealers. And then when they went there, they went there with uh, a tip off. Exactly. They didn't just go there with their clumsy heads yeah. or their clumsy ideas. No, 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 yeah. yeah. They, they went there because somebody told them that it's a hot spot. And that's a community. Remember, Operation Pidula is a community. Yeah and the implementation to, to take this thing forward. Yeah. So it was actually the community telling other yeah. community members that since you guys are going there, there's another guy to go to. So this thing was a community being together. Yeah. But at the same time, it had, you know, bumps in which people, you know, are having a hard time finding these people because there are some people who are on the inside there are some people who are all ears for these guys yeah. that are dealing yeah. so yeah, it, it, might, it might it might somehow you know I don't know I, I don't want to say much as much as I said it's, <laughs> it's, 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 I'm just a talker right I'm just a talker so I just want to know what the people think the masses actually so that we can take a, a profound reason and a profound decision on, on how we can actually get on with this so basically what can be done and what, what can be implemented there's a lot of things but the, the foundation of it all is unity if yeah. we are one yeah we will know it's okay as much as uh sends are lazy to lazy the implementation is the meetings and stuff like that yeah. we have spies within us that are spying for the guys that we are fighting against mm. and their <laughs> names are not written on their foreheads mm. so we cannot see them mm. we cannot so that, that, those particular things that i think people should take uh note of them yeah as much as as much as the operation to do that thing is moving i think members within the operation to do that thing must take charge in finding out who's who and who's not doing what because exactly. Exactly. As much as locals are consumers, locals are dealers. So as much as locals are to operation to dealer thingy, locals are also spying. Yeah. Locals are also against this thing. So it's a very very complex situation yeah. if you look at it in a closer situation because even on an upper scale, yeah, you find politicians involved in the drug thingy. You find uh, uh, politicians being involved in the. The, the operations in which have criminal activities within them the heists you can name them kidnapping human trafficking you can name them these guys these guys are involved so if politicians uh, those are powerful people we know so if those guys are, are engaged and they are involved in this particular movement so it's going to be harder for the community to 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 actually fight this thing why because these people have power and which is their uh, monopoly capital power in which if you have money we know you have capital power yeah. you can control a lot of things yeah so the community if if the members of the community are lesser than maybe i could say the digits in their bank accounts yeah then it could be a problem but if the community is united and everyone is with the same idea the digits don't matter yeah the money their money don't matter their power don't matter whatever position that you are in if we do not bad it it doesn't matter because you are in a position because of us so without us you are positionless so without uh, the people the community us community yeah. so without <laughs> so without us yeah. uh, you are you are jobless you are literally jobless yeah so the reason you have a job the reason you are a premier the reason you are a man is because of me so if i'm not there there's no man there's no cop there's no so we need to acknowledge the fact that if we stand together as a nation stand together as the people we are the bosses of them all because their operations the companies every business operates due to the needs of the people so if the people no longer have those particular needs of those particular people they can do it by themselves then what's the use for these people Nada. okay on that issue yeah i'd also like to ask um what would you recommend um as a community we do to tackle the issues of maybe less opportunities opportunities uh, business-wise opportunities what would you recommend the community does the community does yeah i like your question because you are not asking me of 
what the government what officials can do yeah. in order to, yeah, to tackle yeah. this situation. Wow. We are asking what the community can do because yeah. it, it, yeah, yeah. it takes me back to the point that I've just mentioned. There's a part unit. Yeah. It's a part unit. For instance, it's the three of us like this. I can, because uh, um, if it's the three of us like this, we are just a, a, a small community. Yeah. I'll, I'll, I'll put it that way. Yeah. We are a small community. So, solo, you have uh, 50 bucks. I call this money circulation. We have you have fifty bucks, and uh, with this fifty bucks you want a haircut. You come through to me. I give you a haircut. I take your fifty. Bucks. But now I need food now. I mean I don't need a haircut. I need food. Yeah. I take your fifty. Bucks, the one that you gave to me. I go to Kid. Kid is selling food. I give it to Kid. Kelly gives me food. The 50 rand that I gave to Kelly to buy food, Kelly must take it to you when you are selling shoes, you are selling apparel, the apparel, the clothes. Yeah. Uh, you know, you know, you know, you know so if Kelly needs to wear, he must take the 50 rand, come to you. You must come back to me. Exactly. So, so if you look at it, at a very closer perspective, the 50 rand didn't go anywhere, yeah. which means the only room for the money to go outside the boundaries between the three of us is the money that's coming in, yeah. which means one of us have to go get money somewhere, come back, distribute it amongst any of one of us, uh, amongst one of us, yeah. so that um, we could we could we could we could grow the economy. Uh, uh, for instance. We need to implement ways in which we could satisfy the trend needs, the things that people need the most. That's what because we were talking about. The uh, yeah, yeah. yeah the, the businesses, ne? if you want to start a business, you have yeah. to know what is the biggest problem that are pe people are facing. Yeah. Then you come up with a solution, right? Exactly. That's how to say it. So, so, so basically, if you know that uh, people need this the most, you start that business and people must support you. All the way. I'm telling you, if you have 100% support from the people, they cannot stop you from shooting to the moon. So, so, so the unity in which was my basic opinion about everything here, the school map, is unit. So if people can just unify and, and, and unite and, and, and just come up with you know solid reasons to start businesses because nowadays ne, i see people starting unnecessary businesses and when they crash they cry it's because you you cannot exactly you cannot sell me something that i do not need and say that i didn't support you i didn't need that thing yeah so 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 exactly so if you could maybe find ways of implementing uh, ways to eradicate less opportunities in the community will be to have uh, to provide for needs that are trendy in the community and you take charge and you provide in that trendy uh, need that you see in the community you will get the cash flow and from the cash flow it's the capital power I, mean, I believe i personally believe in the capital power because it can, con can control it with things the resources um, making sure that the movement goes paying bills maintaining everything in general the capital power has a lot of effect so if we could just gain the capital power as a, un a, a united community, um, having to cater in is it the same in, in the community? For instance, we don't have people who are actually selling cars in the community. I mean, I would be very impressed if I could see garage and dicing in the location. The location, yeah. yeah. Cars, yeah. Own, cars, own, so, car dealership. So, so people are buying cars these days. Yeah. Yeah. The reason I'm saying that is people are buying cars these days. So, it's, it's particularly one of the trendy needs. Yeah. You understand what I'm saying? So, you just need to be brave. If you have to take a loan, take it. If you have to get a certain capital from anybody, just do whatever you, you, you need to take. Yeah. Feel as petrol. Petrol is a trendy need in the community. People, a lot of people are driving cars. Yeah. So if you provide for the community petrol, you won't have to go to Amayamaka, Ratinga, Mwabiza, Makam to get petrol. Because you are a local person, if you buy petrol from you, don't you think you will always run out of petrol and that will force you to grow even bigger?
Okay, since I can't hear you, very yes, and general upon comment, yes, comments. Comments. As, as, as to, I, we don't want who is misleading with our opinions because actually it's just that Baba talking, we are talking, we're just talk, talking too much. He's talking, they're asking me questions. They're just talking. So, in order for this not just to be a talk, talk, yeah, can you talk, talk, so that well. we can but actually take talk. action or you know implement ways or share ideas on you on how we can actually evaluate or elevate uh, our community and just this movement in particular on how we can also go and vaccinate vaccination he he just said we should go and vaccinate What's your take on that? What's your take on that? What's your take on this? I've been dying to hear my niggas talk about this. What's your take on that? 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 the guys to be the ones about to buy vaccination because it has been a very controversial topic yeah so a lot of people said this and that yeah, everyone has so, it yeah. 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 yeah me and michelle especially when it comes to things that i can say and they end up offending a certain person no matter how true they are no matter how big exactly. they are yeah. but they sometimes end up offending certain people and yeah. then they end up you know going against somebody's opinion and that person in some type of way so i mean I, i'm afraid of that so i'm not gonna say anything so no, wait, no, what's your what's your take on vaccination vaccination my brother have you taken one no i have yes, not no, 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 i have not you have it reason being i have don't you? trust vaccination yeah. um, mr cameraman um, um, have you taken your vaccination um, too I'm still, still, still skeptical. Yeah, yeah. Still skeptical. Mm. They are it's not like vaccinated. Guys, These guys are it's not like vaccinated. Guys, yeah, All yeah. of them. But are then I know one thing. I mean, only one one guy can be vaccinated. But then I don't think he's vaccinated. Who? Only you can be vaccinated. Yeah. But then I don't he's think vaccinated. you are. Oh, you, Me, you, you he works with vaccines. vaccines. I wear with vaccines. You work with vaccines. It's just you, my brother. Right here. I definitely know you. A lot of these Same. guys are not vaccinated. I'm not vaccinated. So he's not and I'm vaccinated. I'm not gonna get vaccinated. Anytime. Okay, okay, let me be brief. How about we take that I'm to the street? I'm not vaccinated too. How about we take that to the street? Uh, let's take the vaccination thing. Yeah, let's take yeah. that to the street. And okay, also we got, we're gonna operation. take it to the streets and we're gonna take it to the comment box as well. So, vaccine thing, make sure that you tell us what you think about it. Because comment. we're gonna ask some people on the road what they think about it. Yes, so, about this now. vaccination thing. Yeah, because it's also a government thing in, in which you know they tell us to vaccinate uh, by, by force and, and 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 some people are here in south africa yeah, and they cannot be captured systematically if they're vaccinated or not so is it really fair we, we got that, people who don't even got ids my name you know what i'm saying no id so how can they get vaccinated because you know ids and stuff like that they are the ones that are used to capture you in my right card yeah? those are the same yeah, people you should be bro you think I, I am? Don't know if I am. Nah, the thing is, in order for okay. So what do you need if I get there? I want to get vaccinated. And you what do I do? You need your documentation. Maybe you need your ID, okay. your Islam number, your your passport number. Yeah. So many so what that, what happens to the people who don't have those documentations? But they are they, can, they cannot be vaccinated. They cannot be vaccinated because they cannot be registered on the healthcare mm. what what system. Yeah. Yeah, so 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 who's more forced to vaccinate? The one that doesn't have documents or the one that has documents? Everyone is forced. Everyone is forced. Yeah. But then so they don't have but, but now the person the person that doesn't have the documents cannot vaccinate. Yeah. They by default. Yeah. Yeah. So let's say so you force them. For yeah. Can you vaccinate them actually without having the documentation by force? I, I can't. So they, are, saying, so they are not for they need to be registered so in order for you or are registered yeah, in order for you to they be, need to be registered in yeah. order for you to be <laughs> vaccinated they you need have to be, to be registered on the database of health mm -hmm. yeah. so in order for you to get that vaccination whatever vaccination that you choose could be pfizer uh, could no be johnson yeah, uh, johnson johnson registered mm -hmm. 
because uh, mostly you find that uh, nurses don't find you in the system if you don't have your documentation and so on and so on. So automatically, the people problems. that that don't have I'm the really documentation. You know why? That. Why are you skeptical? I'm not. I'm not. I'm not even. Scared. I'm very scared. I, I do not want that why? shit. Why? Why? The reason being, age. Like. Guys, like, come on, okay. come on. These people have been controlling us for too long, bro. Now they bring vaccinations. Bro, I take a vaccination now, then after three years, I grow a tail. Uh -huh. What is that? Uh -huh. What is that? Uh -huh. I'm just saying, uh -huh. as we're just talking, bro. As we're talking. Come on, dog. What the fuck, bro? I don't even know that shit, but then I have to get vaccinated. Because if I'm not vaccinated, I can't get a job. And if I can't get a job, I can't feed my family, my neck. Two so, dead. My neck. So, like, bro, what the fuck? Uh, I love my son. He's I, gonna grow it in. Bro, bro, I am scared of them. It's good. <laughs> Yo, me, I will never oh, Not anytime soon. Not anytime soon. Not anytime soon. Yeah, because I, I once tried net it uh, in Pretoria, net, but then I won't mention the the medical place name because like it's a big company, so I, I won't say. Uh, I came there, net. then I was like, I even asked them the, the same question I just said now. I was like, okay, fine. I wanna get vaccinated, net, but then. I don't know if after a few years there'll be like after effects and what, but what if I grow a tail? That's what I said. And they all laugh. And then they told me, nah, it's issue by the course. You have to get this in the is killing me. Bro. The tail thinking is killing me. You're not giving me enough information. You're not even trying to con like to convince me to get vaccinated. You just tell me that I have to get vaccinated. What? My nigga, if you can't convince me, confuse me, my nigga. Exactly. If you feel that, nah, get out of here, man. Get out of here, get out of here, bro. My nigga, get out of here. Bro. Okay, yeah, I see, I see the vaccination thing in there, and then, but now the thing is that uh, what I'm concerned about is that I don't want to be this normal, my nigga. Very normal. Now I guess so. And the the jab, they call it the jab. Call it the jab. jab. Yeah. I want to be that near this one on opposite sides of the vaccination So trust me, I am, I am opposite of that thing. I imagine, not imagine you're getting a jab from Yo. from 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 a from a, a punching that that that. Send me cheap. Imagine. Send me cheap. Automatically, if you send your robots, they can track me. They can watch what. Ah, come on, bro. Do you really think that there's something? Uh, that they, they put inside except for bro, the, for the nah, thing. that shit bro, ah, that jab is something else I'm telling you now, you might not believe me now but then trust me that jab is something, okay maybe it's helpful I'm not saying I am not vaccinated but like I'm not sure very, we, we, but, but like they always say we have to keep each other safe you have to get vaccinated to keep others like to protect your loved ones and all that so I'm very safe to have a time to so when I can't see my mother, I'm not a vaccinator. I'm not a vaccinator. You hear me? Even my mother. He's exposing the female. Nah, I'm not even exposing them. I'm telling the facts. I'm exposing the female. No, as vaccinator. But now you see. No. You see what the government will say. You don't even know me. You see what the government will say when they see this video. See this video. They will say when. Convince me. Yeah, if you can't Joshua. convince me, confuse me. <laughs> this guy. That's what I'm saying. This guy is the dude running the community. Telling Because me, I'm not sick. My nigga, are you sick? <laughs> I'm not sick. No, I'm vaccinated. I'm, I'm not vaccinated. Exactly. <laughs> my nigga, are you sick? No. Are fam. you vaccinated? No, fam. Ask me, my nigga. Are you sick? Hell no. Are you vaccinated? Hell no. <laughs> I'm still alive. But I'm our community alive. is sick. <laughs> yeah. And it needs to yeah. be vaccinated. Yeah. So let us get a vaccine that we can use to vaccinate. As our I community. said, I'm on the negative side. With them drugs. Side. We have to debate on that. Exactly. We have to get both perspectives. You know. Yeah, true exactly. That. That's why I'm so let us get on the opposite side. Definitely. Drop your comments, you know. Say what you have what in your mind is. and heart. Just is. spit it out. Don't so, be afraid I'm here. I'm live, I'm saying my shit. The government might arrest me. Nah, they will never do that. I'm gonna go live. Just take it to the street, just wrap it. Uh, so, as much as we've been talking about vaccines, uh, the community needs a serious vaccine, serious injection. And it's time to eat the streets. You know what I'm saying? So, we, 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 have, to, we have to find ways 
of finding a right vaccine for the community, finding the right jabs the for right the community, jabs. because the community is suffering from the illness in which we call drugs, and then we don't less have opportunities, we don't and, have you know, you know, less, uh, less implementations, less ideas, less engagement, Even less positivity, now, less units, yeah. less everything. Oh. You know what I'm saying? Those are diseases that are killing the community. They need vaccines. I'm sorry. So we're gonna have to find the right vaccines and jabs and injections that we can to the community. And communities will be actually be more than willing to accept those type of jabs. I tell you, they will accept it more than the Pfizer and the Johnson and Johnson. So guys, make sure we try to find ways. We try to find uh, whatever it is that we've been talking about. Every know what it is in every time. What takes it? It's called Nutis Vaccinator. I'm not sure what I'm doing. 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 I'm not what type of vaccine that you need. So just tell us in the community. We don't know what type of Drop your type of vaccination that you need. We don't know what type of vaccination you need, so just tell us. Just tell us in the comment box. Tell us in the comment section. We're gonna get you the vaccine. We're gonna do everything in our power to make sure that you get yourself that vaccination. And then we're gonna you. And then and then, then you and then we can move forward. But uh before we even close up with everything, we have to ask the people here. Yeah, we gotta so we gotta on them streets in right the about in the you now, see us yeah, right now. Two seconds. You know what it is. Still talking. Yeah, 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 yeah. So, yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm wearing them dance and again. I'm with Ubavo here, our chef. Uh, I'm with Solo here. You know what I'm saying? Everything is going pretty well. We are on the streets now. Don't say a little bit dark now. But we're just going to ask. Um, one or two young people because uh, this show is about young people really, in general so we're just gonna get a few young people and ask them just a few questions on what we've been talking about and then we're gonna wrap it up let's go baby so i got my guy here uh, how's it bro shut up you got you can you tell us your name please Richard. Uh, thanks for your time man my name is my name is my pigs yeah, but we are on the power show we are uh, we're just gonna ask you a few questions so solo is gonna ask you the first question so solo man get on to him my man Bro, yo this is your boy h malume h you know what it is malume h then richard yeah. first question are you vaccinated um no reason being reason being is wuti um da it's not never vaccinated, you have need, Yes, sir. So, yeah, I have need, like, you have vaccinated. So, it actually raises skepticalism towards everyone that hasn't vaccinated yet. It was a control of the population, you vaccine. So, young and corner to me now, you vaccine, one man. That's the conspiracy that has been evolving around the community that the vaccinations are not good. That's why people are not vaccinating. People are less informed about the vaccination. That's why people are not vaccinating. People don't know what is being brought inside their bodies. That's why they do not vaccine. Which so is why don't blame people if they don't vaccine. Which is what I said before. If you can't convince me, confuse me. Exactly if, what if it is. Oh, I don't know what it is. That's what it is. So the second question now. What can we do, my man, to eradicate the drug abuse and the selling of drug in our community? Because it's definitely demolishing our community. What is it that we can do as a community? Forget the, the government, forget the uh, SAPS or whoever is working for the government. As an individual, as a community, what is it that you could probably do using the law, obviously? You know, following the follow protocols and pro follow the, the proper post procedures. What can you do? Um, there are problems. It's I'm going to call it this night in the community because man, in this world, it's a cool, it's my right, yes, sir. No, my right, it's a cool, yes, sir. No, sing lines of chairs to me. I'm going to say, next in the Malung, okay. I go, no, pay me, 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 in a way, I'm not saying it, but it is the law that perpetuates 
the the consumers yeah, because we can talk about the dealers as much as we can but the consumers if they are in high demand of the substance that is being sold to them then there's less that we can do as this guy says right here there's nothing much that we can do if the consumers have been protected by the same law that we are trying to use to eradicate this particular situation now the last question my man to not waste your time so so our last question yeah? are you familiar with the operation to do that thing led by an uh, Lux? um i'm familiar with uh, one thousand yeah. yes okay well the operation to do is actually just uh, an implementation that has been taken by a community to come together and try to fight crimes fight illegal immigrants fight uh, illegal stuff that do not follow the proper and uh, uh, procedures and proper laws of the country so it's actually about putting the south africans first and actually making sure that uh, south africans are prioritized uh, uh, in terms of moving forward and making sure that people uh, especially young people are progressive in whatever that they are doing without the minor glitches such as drugs and the things that we are talking about in general yeah. so it's particularly the uh, implementation that has been taken uh, by some people is led by Intatalax and is currently be uh, been arrested for 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 raiding somewhere by an EFF member. So that particular movement, what do you think about it as a community? Do you think people should engage more on or should maybe try to be less on it because it might cause conflicts? Uh, people may say anything upon it. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. So I just want to hear your own view upon it. Is the, is it the right thing to be done or is it the wrong thing? Ah, my you see this is crime this is crime so so uh, that, that that's what you think can be done yeah so well uh, you heard it from our guy so we're gonna get our next guy before the last guy and then we're gonna wrap it up thank you for your time my man so we're back and uh, i've got uh, my elderly uh, brother here proti he is one of the popular members in the community that doesn't tolerate nonsense he actually beats up people that uh, are doing crime and he actually beats them uh, using a verbal beating not physical beating so he's not breaking crime he's using verbal beating and he's actually just you know i know him i know him so uh, my man protein do you think i are doing enough do you think who many ones are into a and a in some of the is the main fan of giving and paratin yeah boy one my figures the I like it. I like it. I like it. I so our elderly brothers here just told us that he is actually impressed about the implementation and the moves that we are making as young people as a community to try and eradicate and address the situations that we are facing as a community so right now we're just gonna go to our last brother or before the brother that is gonna be the last and ask a few questions and see what they can say about what we are doing or what the community is doing or what operation Tutula is doing let us get them yeah. You thought you thought I'm out. I'm not out, Baba. I'm still here. And uh, right we now, I back. have our chef, the one that I showed you before. We have our own. Uh, right chef. now, our it's chef has to say something <laughs> about what what we've been talking about. So, uh, uh, Mr. Linda, I'm gonna introduce uh, himself uh, on his behalf. Uh, he's Linda Zwane. He goes by Mr. Meat. That's the uh, the movement that he's making. He's very nasty with the meeting thing. He's an entrepreneur. So I wish that you support him because he's one of the people that are going forward with implementation of the uh, youth unemployment rate eradication so he has done it by himself he didn't need any government thingy so mm. we're gonna ask him since he's a very efficient uh, 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 community member so Bavo, uh, what do you think 
the community can do in order to control or eradicate the situation in the community. Yeah, my God. Yeah, and so you introduce our foods. Do it again. No as Mr. Meats, you know what I mean. <laughs> you know what it is. <laughs> yeah, but what the communities can do, my guy, because uh, like we cannot really rely on the government, because the government has failed us already. You see, because during Njobubo, I would say how the situation is like. Gosh, right. I think we should take it upon ourselves through certain organizations, through certain uh, uh, what, what, what do you call movements? This? Movements. Anything. You see, like one of those Tutula movements. You yes, see, sir. to try and eradicate some situations around the communities. But now we are facing we are facing situations now whereby uh, the leaders or people yeah. that are actually yeah. empowering people yeah. to do these things and be in action are being arrested by the cops and they are being you know uh, being um, disturbed by the the, the the laws somehow like our brother that we've just interviewed before yeah, he just yeah, told yeah, us yeah, that yeah, yeah. Uh, kids have rights that actually make them get protected uh, from being stopped into using illegal substances so yeah. those particular things are things that are, are becoming a problem when it comes to us exactly. actually taking charge, taking charge as a community to uh, uh, address situations like this oh, right. so do, do you think maybe the law uh, it can work with the 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 people or do you think it, it's really unnecessary for us to follow the proper procedures at this point my guy you know, you know when you're going to war this is a war okay yeah? there's always casualties you know what there's always casualties of war. casualties of war so uh, as much as said as it is these people are going to be casualties of this but it's a war that must be fought you see one way or another yes sir you see? so the movement should continue whether or not you see because i'm sorry for our brothers that get arrested and all, but it was for a necessary cause so right now so right now i just want you to layer a little bit on your opinion on what can the law do to actually not be in our way or not be in our leader's way into taking charge because if i'm a leader and i'm taking action and i have to be afraid of being arrested because yeah. i'm taking yeah. certain actions exactly. towards helping the community uh, while the law is actually the one that is protecting the community so if i'm breaking the law i will get arrested obviously so what can the law practically do to maybe try and compromise i don't know what can they do to actually you know make sure that the people who are actually moving forward and trying to ways to move forward uh, as a community uh, cannot be disturbed what, what is it that can they do in general you know as i've said before the law is failing it's so it has already failed it's already failed it doesn't have a room it anymore have a room anymore so at that point i no longer comment so magni get to get a new one time so one time. so, <laughs> so you yeah one of my favorite our people are tired guys so I, I, hope, I hope i hope i hope you don't get offended or i hope you don't think exactly. uh, we are perpetuating yeah. violence or we are just perpetuating anybody. expression of now, opinions and expression of uh speeches as as much as we are asking them we have to know what they think and how they feel so if but agni it means they cartel they, they cartel a bit young taller they, they are tired you see right now so right now if they if they say vele or gunyak sasebenzi like they are no longer gonna use it because it hasn't been working for a lot of time so i'm not trying to justify them i'm just trying to put you in a clearer form because maybe i understand him better than you do so it is what it is so we're just gonna it's get one, one more just one more brother Oh sister, I don't know which one we're gonna find. That thing is Segumnya Mama and uh, we're gonna have to wrap it up. So we're just gonna hear uh, uh, get one brother because the brothers vele they don't they don't they don't give a care whether it's dark or whether it's daylight. So as much as is it is it is dark, we're gonna get a brother, obviously. So let's get them. Yeah, so as much as this is okay with this thing. We're gonna have our brother right here that we've just collected yeah. somewhere there on the streets. And he's a young person and we always see him around, you know, making moves, he's working, which means he's part of the people that are actually trying ways to go forward. So right now we're gonna take his opinions and his speeches and whatever that he, he thinks about what we are talking about. My man, can we just know your name first before we even start asking you questions? Are you doing good, sir? I'm good, I'm good. What's your name, sir? My name is Ngoskona, but known as Mike. Mike. 
Ricky. His real name is Ghost Corner. So, Baba Ghost Corner, faith. No offense, sick bum and just a wood eighty. We don't want to waste your time. Sick fun and you booze and you would see. Are you are you familiar with Operation Tutola? No, I'm not. Okay, Operation Tutula is a movement, a community led by Intatalax currently uh, er er eradicates some drugs, illegal immigrants and stuff, type of stuff like that. So it's just the community, Elisa Upkebeng, Unezite, Kabanguti, Abanta Bailandili, you know, certain people, Snegas Bash, Umtambu, Sibanga Mawa Twat, or Bakamar Lipiz, Patinje, Abantu Bomparat, Basa South Africa, Bafunu Utibaz, Utige, eh. Ba move around and forward, so basically, this is operation there. So the operation to do that thing is something like that. So, do you think the operation to do that thing is it a good thing or is it a bad thing? Or is it a bad thing? Well, I will let me say the reason that it's a bad thing. It's a bad thing. Bad thing. Okay. Can you explain maybe why you think it's a it's a bad thing? Because more than just super around the cars and things. Certain guys are trying to push, but man, you can't let go. So, you know, I was so shy, I what not to have on Facebook. I mean, I'm going to have to discourage and cool. As a community? As a community. Yes, sir. You know, I was so shy, 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 I was so shy. I actually understand him, and I'm going to explain why I understand him. So, another thing, do you think the police officers and the the law in general is working enough to these particular things that we are facing or they are just relaxing and we can no longer use them then doing nothing my guy from okay. my side of you they are doing nothing because there are a lot of shit that are happening Damn. So I'm managing. I should go listen. Corner, corner. There are certain things that are going to be like we're going to be down. Guys, sit down. So I go in the garden. Nix, we call all our managers. Fifteen minutes ago, can't get over the security. Imagine. We are going to take you serious in the bar. Okay, yeah, yeah. So they are doing. They are not doing enough, my guy. So it's important that as a community we take charge. Yeah, we think it's important. We do. We we have to stand up. And fight these kind of things because man, you listen to things like a lot like us, and I like down eventually. These are prices. Okay, just my last question here, just to wrap this up. What is it to get that as a community, Singatanga, and probably CNZ, in order to to address this situation? From what I could say, as you tell like us, and I like down. Yes, sir. If you could be united. We still keep her because some of the things that is in the Galalana, Milena, we may have a corner is this or from certain communities. We could speak any nine, you got the gas, So, some is big puzzles, my baby could buy a corner, but let's understand that. But these were in the shoot stand up and take action. Yeah, okay. So, guys, as you've heard, our guy right here just told us, we would see. The, the, the law enforcement, uh, the government in general, is actually uh, putting more, less opportunities into action, into place. So that pushes a lot of locals to be in the corner, whereby they commit crimes they don't want to commit, but because they don't have a choice. So they end up now doing these crimes. So operations like Tudula end up uh, messing up those people's vision as well because probably I, i'm not gonna say anything uh, you know what my opinion is just gonna be wrapped up right now because uh, i know the thing is i've mentioned earlier on would see there are some people who are making an income out of these illegal, illegal things and uh, these people and are locals and they actually they're feeding families but the thing is uh, they don't have a choice so if the government could implement ways in which are legal and they can actually work to actually make sure we see a community move forward. Everything we've said right now, like it just brings us back to the it puzzles together. So it, it 
Buffett, so just make sure we see you do the right thing. Comment so that he, it's not just us and yeah. the guys we collect on the streets about cool Malente. Just make sure we see you go to that comment section and uh, we show something and uh, we take it into head and uh, we will make sure we see whatever it is that in our power. If it, if you have to get more people, we'll get more people, we have to get uh, more officials, we we'll get more officials. We we'll have to do more research, we we'll do more research. If we have to get more equipment, we we'll get more equipment. If we have to uh, do more action, we we'll do more action. If to, to more wrap it up, more wrap it up. If to see you next week, we'll see you next week. We're gonna see you in the next episode. We're gonna see you in the next episode. If we're gonna have to switch off the camera, we're gonna switch off the camera. If you have to go, we have to go. If I have to thank you, my brother, for your time, I have to well, thank you, my brother, for your time. If, to if to I can toilet, tell my nigga salt, is my good nigga go to the toilet, you gotta go to the toilet. And me, I've been chewing the bubble gum for the whole but, but guys. Uh, I'm sorry for chewing the bubble gum for, for the I have a gum problem, so this bubble gum is a special type of bubble gum that treats my my gums they swell a lot so i pardon me for chewing the bubble gum throughout the show i'm really sorry it's really inappropriate i hate bubble gums but you know so i understand that some people hate them too so if you see somebody chewing the bubble gum it actually irritates you it's not about that we are about to wrap it up i think because i'm not a present i'm not good at this thing so it's how i wrap it up it's uh, whatever I'm doing too. but this is our guys we are here where people are consuming drugs. so it's what it is you can just view me wherever you want to view me you me here if you look at the background it's happening if you look at this side it's happening let's go my man we are going there's nothing that we can do yes sir yes sir i just got to you know what it is you know what it is